I'm Mike Mellon here from DirtTrackDodgers.com with tonight's uh, Diamond Nationals Big Block Small Block winner, Mike Guler. And Mike, and that was a hell of a race and a great way to cap off 2020 here at Big Diamond. Yeah, definitely. Uh, I didn't think we had anything in the beginning there for them guys. Uh, they were really setting a, a fast pace and uh, glad that the uh, track slowed down a little bit and we were able to get, a, get a around them all. Talk about the season here at Big Diamond. I mean, awesome year. You know, you got the championship and then, you know, yesterday, a little off, you know, started deep, it was tough. But tonight, everything, you know, came together for you. And again, all smiles here in the pits. Yeah, definitely. I mean, anytime you can get a bunch of wins, a, a track and win the title. And uh, it's good to represent tonight. And uh, definitely it feels good. And we'll be back next year. Talk about that race. You know, again, you mentioned it early on. Track was tough. Uh, you know, you, everybody was kind of up there on that cushion, which, again, totally different than we saw last night. And then as the race went on, it looked like the bottom finally started to come around. Yeah, uh, once it slowed down and got a little bit of black through the middle, it got it got the, brought the bottom back down. The top got pretty wide there in three and four. One and two, it was still really good. Um, but you just get so hung out, and, and uh, you got to be able to run the bottom here to make moves. So, at one point, I think it was uh, you, Tyler, and, and Ryan Creechin, or Tyler Dibble, Ryan Creechin. You're three wide going into turn one. What are you thinking there? <laughs> just make it through. Uh, yeah, I mean, them guys were running hard, and uh, hats off to them. I mean, they're a bunch of young guys, and they really run good. And uh, you know, be glad to be able to beat him, that's for sure. Ryan bobbled there a little bit on the bottom. How close were you to getting into him? Because it looked like he had to check up because he came right up the racetrack. Yeah, we hit. It was. Uh, it looked like he got into an infield tire, and I had a good run ahead of steam across the top, and I wasn't going to let off. So I was like, well, we're not going to finish third. We're either going to win this thing or, or wreck it. But uh, it paid off, and uh, we lucked out and survived that one. And that was really the only close call, uh, maybe one other one. But uh, all in all, a good night and happy to have a good – good draw and the redraw and uh, that definitely made a difference too big week coming up for you guys I mean how important is it to have momentum like this going into what we know is coming this weekend uh, it's definitely huge uh, you know it'll help at the shop it'll help with uh, morale and confidence and uh, a little bit of confidence in me because we've struggled with the big block program a lot and uh, we're more respect you know 358 team that's uh, we have all the stuff to run big block but definitely you know geared towards 358s is what we grew up doing and that's what we know so Feels good to do good in the big block. Mike, congratulations. Thank you. In here with Mike Guler, tonight's winner here at the Big Diamond Speedway, night number two of the Diamond Nationals.